guy, right? I was talking to the Dolby guys. I got to start off with that. Oh, talking man. To the Dolby guys talking about target curves because that's 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 my area of expertise, I guess you could say, because it's what I do all the time. I pulled an all nighter last night calibrating. Who does that? Yeah. You know, I, you. You know me. Right. Why? Because magic beans, magic beans, true target. Yeah. So I'm always testing this stuff reading about it and trying to figure out what other people think, you know, different opinions, even if they disagree, sometimes it's good to have a, a good conversation. Yeah. And yeah. what I've noticed is people who are confident in what they do and they really know what they're talking about. You don't, it's almost like you don't mind a bit of back and forth, a, you know, a disagreement on a topic because you may learn something, you know, people who are very closed off, I find are, maybe they don't really know what they're talking about. They don't about. know shit. They I don't want to go. This guy was talking about. So this guy, he's on a panel, right? For Dolby, talking about about, about teaching. By the way, about teaching Atmos he, and yeah, he teaches. Yeah. yeah. So he's oh. talking about yeah, you know, uh, you know, you got to take care of those room nodes. No. So Mode. Mode. Say it's room modes. Okay. A quick Google search. You type in room nodes. Is there is there a reason why people think it's nodes aside from the fact that it sounds like it? Yeah, I don't know. You've heard you it don't before. Nodes. You don't know. I don't know. <laughs> lymph nodes. What do you got? Lymph nodes. Lymph nodes. Uh, lymph nodes. <laughs> but but the, my only my thing is that if you've ever typed that out, researched it, written it down, anything besides just word of mouth, because that tells me that you've only heard it from somebody else. Because the moment you go to type it, you'll get a you know autocorrect. You mean room modes, right? Hmm. Right, and then from then on, you know what what the deal is. So anyway, this guy's talking about uh, target curves, and I said, so you know, Dolby has a music target curve, right? Which they want everybody to apply. I'm like, hmm, that's weird. Like, doesn't it depend on the room, right? And he said, well, we want it to sound the same everywhere. Ah, good luck. I, said, uh, <laughs> well, I think if you right, apply the same right. target and it's different speakers and different rooms. It's gonna sound um, different. They're gonna sound different. Yeah. And this guy off to the side who was also talking to this guy, I guess, you know, sometimes you talk to somebody, somebody else is there mm-hmm. hanging around. He's like, and I mentioned Dr. Tool. I'm like, oh, I don't know. And he's like, Oh yeah, this guy works at Harmon, right? This other guy. I, I it seems like everybody works at Harmon. I know, <laughs> anyway, right? He jumps I'm in. Gonna, I don't I'm know. Harman too. He could be a he could I don't know what he does he does there, but he's like, You should listen to that guy. I said what do you, you know, he just jumped in. That was the first thing he said. You should listen to that guy. Oh, so well, yeah. I am. Yeah. Let me just real fact, because you meant, yeah, you mentioned this before um, in the in the chat. I was wondering, like, are you and this other guy friends? Like, or did he just like randomly, like, he he's just, just like, were you ignoring this dude? He's just there. Like, he's, just there. he's just sitting there. I'm just saying, table. like, who just randomly, like, looks at the guy next to him? Like, are you paying attention to this? Like, no, well, imagine a panel, right? Yeah. So a panel of uh, four people. And then afterwards, people like to go and talk to them, right? Yeah, he was standing there and he's, you know, talking to the guy and we're all kind of like, you know, asking him questions and I'm kind of disagreeing with him right? because I don't think that that's correct. What he said, because it's Joe and he likes to disagree with you. (laughs) No, I don't like to justify. Anyway, I I told the guy, "Um, no, well, you know, I think this and this and the other guy kind of made it sound like, you know, you should listen to him. Yeah, Like kind of like, like, yeah, you should be quiet and like listen to what he has to say. I'm like. This is what I do, you know, and he's like, well, you know, this and that. He's like, you should use smart to, you know, to determine what if what you're doing is correct. Oh, hold on. Hold on. The dude who works for Harmon said you should use smart. Yeah. He didn't say you should be using Sistune, which I believe is a JBL product. I may be Uh, wrong, uh, but I know that's what they use in synthesis. Maybe they quit using it. I find that interesting. I think they purchased. I think that's I think smart was. Like it's been purchased. It was like part of their thing for a while. Like it just keeps moving around. It's been around for a long time. Right. And so I said, oh, yeah, well, I know about that. You know, I have people who work on the DSP at JL Audio. I mean, I know a few people. Yeah. And then and then he goes and he says, well, because I was disagreeing with the guy, he goes, well, do you have a PhD in acoustics? I said, do you have a PhD? This guy asked Joey. Said, Joe, Joe was like a play a hating degree. I said, this guy's got a player hating degree for sure. You know, and then I said, hey, you're being disrespectful. <laughs> I said, you, you know, why are you being like, 
you you know it kind of got to that level i was like what, what's up yeah well, I, I don't know you you know that's kind of a weird thing to tell somebody yeah right, right. um anyway I'll, I'll circle back to that later on and that's why i had to drop them like yeah you know i mean i get to talk to some of the smartest people my my buddy has a clipple near field scanner in his living room <laughs> yeah that's you and he's like, Aaron, and he, that's you I did say that, right and then you yeah. know what he said he's like he like we have oh, we all have clipples. We have so many. We have a bunch so of them. So what? We have a bunch of them at Harmon. So what? I'm like, yeah, but you don't have one in your living room, though, right? Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> this dude's weird. Like, I mean, it sounds like that dude is kind of like. Anyway, people are different, man. Like, you just have to, as an engineer, you know, like I work with other engineers, and I will say that. The major everybody I work with directly are like really cool, down to earth people. They're not your prototypical engineer, but I have worked mm -hmm. with prototypical engineers who are like super nerdy, think everything is about them, think they're smarter than everybody else. Mm -hmm. And usually they're not, they're not the smartest person in the room. They're like three or four or five people behind. Um, so I don't know, <laughs> man. Behind. That's funny. Yeah, man. Yeah. I mean, that's just weird. <laughs> I don't know how you were able to stand that. I'm, I'm, but uh, listen, honestly, and the, I hope this doesn't sound bad or weird, but I'm proud of you for saying like I, you're kind of disrespecting me right now. Like that's a good instead of being like, "Yo, hold up, son, you want to take this outside?" You just said you're disrespecting me. You're being disrespectful, so that's cool. Yeah, I give him a chance. You know what I mean? I give him. Yeah. I give him. I'm not like a. I'm not a. I'm not like super tough guy, but I could have taken that guy for sure. <laughs> <laughs> but he is i mean the dude's wrong i mean like he's I'm actually sure incorrect. the same curve does not mean the same sound period even if if it's the exact same speakers okay yeah. but if if it's not then it's not gonna be the same sound game over yeah. in a discussion or, or the same room the room the guy's like it's gonna be the same in every room <laughs> yeah that uh dude that's, even a clear, clear, that's not gonna be that's not gonna happen. i double checked though i double checked i said are you saying it's gonna sound the same in every single situation, if we use the same target, he's like, "Yeah, that's." Yep. I think this, yep. he's like, "That's why we use it. Like, we want it to sound the same." I'm like, Whoa. "Maybe, maybe if you are in the near field. I mean, I'm talking like within like a foot or two, mm -hmm. maybe. But once you start getting down to the room, man, th that's when the radiation pattern comes into play. You know, the reflections yeah. start adding up. Yeah. Well, unless you're yeah. listening to it in an anechoic chamber, then maybe." But yeah, mm -hmm. that dude's just wrong. And um, yeah. that's weird that somebody would, well, he's got a PhD. Well, he's got a PhD in something else that's not this, because otherwise he'd know better. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah exactly. Degree. Yeah. Play ahead of the group. Now, if you can't catch the show, we do have an audio version at anchor.fm slash daily hi-fi. So make sure to go on over there if you like to listen to the show.